Hello. Okay, let's read the question. Aidan had a birthday party at Peter Piper Pizza and invited friends and family. They ate 8 out of 20 of the cake. What percentage of the cake is equal to 8 over 20? And we're using cubes, the strategy for problem solving. And I'm going to get started underlining or highlighting important information. In my first sentence so far, here I don't see any numbers or any math vocabulary. I'm going to keep going to the next one. And here I have A over 20. That's a fraction. Okay, I'm going to keep it. That's the fraction they ate. Okay, I'm going to highlight that too. The question now is what percentage is A over 20? This fraction here. So we did circle or underline by using the highlighters. Now I'm going to box the question and the question is what percentage is a out of 20. And now I box, now I'm going to have to do elaborate. And because I see I have fractions and percent, I'm going to bring a t-chart so I can organize my information. Okay, so for the fraction section, I'm going to be using blue. This is blue. And I'm going to record my fraction. My fraction is A out of 20. That question is find the percent. So they want for us to figure this value here. So on the side, I'm going to simplify the fraction A out of 20. And we, we saw on the questions 1 and 3 that by dividing by the same number or numerator and or denominator, we keep the same value, just a different way to rewrite it with simplest number. That's what is called simplest form. 8 divided by 2, that gives me 4. And 20 divided by 2, that gives me 10. Great. Can I keep simplifying? Yes, I can simply divide by 2 on numerator and divide by 2 on the denominator. 4 divided by 2, that gives me a 2. 10 divided by 2, that gives me Great. Can I keep dividing? The 2 I can divide by 2 and that will give me 1. But can I divide 5 by 2 and have no remainder? It's not going to work. So we found the simplest form. Excellent. And now guys, from here I want to go to percent. And I'm going to bring my flashcards. Great. So now from this fraction, we said we want to go to percent. I want to put it right here. Okay, so I'm going to percent. And I can see in my flashcard that one-fifth is the same as 20% is right here. And that's just one green section. But not on this one. We don't want one green section like this. But now we want two green sections. This is what we want. So we have to repeat this one twice because we're going to use twice the space. And that will be what percent? 40%. Awesome. So we're going to record our value right here. Now let's look at the answer choices. And yes, our answer is letter D. Great job!